So hello everyone, my name is Ronald Kolb, as you may know I'm the author of several books, but also today I don't want to talk about my books, I would like to present you another book, and it's this book here. So the name of the book is Caesar Ritz, Life and Work. And the author is Adalbert Castoni, and well, the book is, is relatively thin, so easy to read, but if you want to get um, a good summary, a good overview about Caesar Ritz, this is your book, um, because it's very fast to read, you can read it in a couple of hours, um, but you have the most important facts about Caesar Ritz. Maybe, uh, well, I guess most of, uh, most of the people will know Caesar, um, but for everyone who had never heard his name yet, um, no, he is um, the, the first real hotelier or the first great hotelier of the 19th century in Europe. And um, by, this, by saying the first great hotelier, it's not that he built one hotel, he really built a brand. So Ritz, um, his, his last name is still known today and um, some hotels still... Um, still hold his name and it, it's a, it was the name in the 19th century for luxury for high class hospitality services. So, and um, Ritz was, was born in Switzerland and he then went from, from several locations like Paris, um, he went to Vienna, Baden-Baden, so he really went through all the European um, capitals and then ended up in London. In London he, he made um, one of his greatest contributions to um, luxury hospitality so he became the uh, manager of the Savoy Hotel and he, he made the Savoy a great success. He, he then was actually kicked out because uh, it was said <laughs> that he um, received some kickbacks from suppliers, um, something that he always denied and he always refused that he ever took something. Anyhow, it, it didn't make any harms to his career. He went on to Paris and in Paris he built his, his own hotel. This was his first hotel that's also built his name and the Ritz in Paris is still a very famous p hotel, of course. And so it, it shortly describes the book, this story, and it goes on then when he, he tries again to conquer um, London and he tried it with two other hotels but I don't want to tell you too much of the story so just it's a good read if you want to have a, a quick nice overview about Caesar Ritz then um, get this book read it and enjoy it thank you very much for listening have a nice day bye bye